Where are all the grown-ups? The world is full of children. What are we going to do? Anything we like. We must travel to the Spartacle Project and realign our dimension with your dimension. Who votes that we go to the Spartacle Project to bring the adults back? So you're in charge now, are you? Wolf with the torch down! Luminite was only ever found in one place. The Black Tor Mine in Yorkshire. So, how are we going to get to the Spartacle Project? to go. I know, but you want us to bring back your mum and the other parents, don't you? It's just luck on the quest. How am I going to know for sure that you're going to be OK? You're not. So you're just going to have to trust me. Take care, bro. And remember, if you find any extra strong, non-sticky hairspray, <laughs> bring it back for me. Yeah, and no borrowing my shoes. <laughs> I thought you might like my library books to teach yourself stuff. Now there's no school anymore. Thanks, Reese. Sadiq's coming! What's that? All aboard the Sparty van. <laughs> Great motor, bad driver. <laughs> Check us out, bad, bro. Right, that's my name. Great old driver. It's going to be tricky without you. Think on your feet and be smart. I'll try, Steve. Love you. Love you too. You can do it, Sadiq. Cat, you all can. Look after each other, okay? Mind your fingers. Project is here. It's going to be a long journey. <laughs> Quiet! Sadiq's driving is rubbish enough without you lot putting him off. Us, Bristol. Destination, Yorkshire Moors. We're going to have to get on the motorway as soon as possible. All these vehicles are really going to slow us down. We need to get off the motorway as soon as possible. Rota for jobs. It is the end of the world! <laughs> I'm on cooking, Jeff's on food sourcing, Liam's on cleaning and you're on washing, and that includes Gretchen. Washing means clothes and stuff, not giving the goat a wash and blow dry. But she smells gross. And she's your pet. So you don't want milk or your cereal anymore then, yeah? Think there might be adults. Why not? Um, you know why not. All the adults are in a parallel dimension. They just want a free ride. Which is working. Look! Cat's right. The grown-ups have gone. And you're so sure about that? You'll risk not having a look. <sighs> See? There's no one here. Just a generator powering the place. I've read my map. You've had your wee stop. So let's go. Whoa, look at that roller coaster. Look at the water. And the water ride. Look at the spinner. Hey, look, we've checked it out. So now let's get back to the Sparty van and onto the Spartacle project, OK? Oh, half an hour won't make a difference. Oh, come on, it'd be so good for us to be kids again. Just the one ride. One. OK. Jordan, Holly. Let's go. Can I come? Too young. Too short and too weird. Wanna go on a ride with me? Oh well, don't I just get all the best jobs? 
Ready? Ready. I don't see why you two can't sit next to each other. Oh, I don't want it to scream in my ear. OK. Well, that was rubbish. Uh, Reese didn't come out? You better go in and get her then. No? On foot? Well, whose stupid idea was it to let her go in on her own anyway? I'm gonna wait here in case she's already out. Shoo! Go! All right. Reese. <laughs> I thought I'd seen a ghost. I just have. Really and truly, Steve. Really and truly. I saw a ghost girl. She was like me, but with brown hair and brown eyes. She was see-through. These places are designed to make your mind play tricks on you. It wasn't a trick. Right? With the luminite? No. The luminite's really useful for magnifying stuff. Light, sound, power. But it can't work miracles. Why do we need a miracle? Because mains water, the type that comes from a tap like this, gets pumped through the pipes by electricity. The main electricity grid is packed up. And now, so is the water supply. So we can't get water from any taps? No. Not inside taps. Not until the questers bring back the parents. Bring back the plumbers, more like. I need to wash my hair. We need to look for a local source of fresh drinking water and then make sure we recycle every drop. I'm reading about how water is precious in the developing world. We are the developing world. to try and find the emergency taps that firefighters use and hope they're still working. OK, let's go. Ready for action. <laughs> Where do you think you're going? Looking for fresh water. You're too young to be going out on your own. That's rubbish. Now all the grown-ups have gone, we're like the new teenagers. <laughs> and I'm the new mum. You're staying here where I know you'll be safe. But I know where we can find fresh water. Oh, yeah? Yeah, there are underground springs running right under our feet. And how are we going to get to them? You find a Y-shaped twig and walk around with it. When it dips, you found water. I read about it. A Y-shaped twig? For water divining. People who did it in the olden days were worshipped. Tia, if I couldn't find an underground spring, then will you worship me? Oh, yeah? And attend to your every need? Yes. Shame you're talking rubbish and going precisely nowhere. Best leave this to us. Ready? 
ready to watch me perform a miracle? Yep. These are all right, love. <laughs> what one? I don't think she likes these onions. <laughs> Ask a question, then. Are they still playing Premier League football matches in the other world? And a Chelsea top. Beware the glittering lights. They will lead you from the same <laughs> path. <laughs> what a load of rubbish. Come on, then. Let's hit the lights. So, we leave for the quest, and an hour later, we stop to have a go on the dodgems. Where are they? It'd be better if we split up to look for them. I'll take Reese. She's still a bit spooked after Terra Castle. All right. Meet you at the Lost Children point. <laughs> Reese, come on, let's check in there. They're not in here. Shift it. Name the night. It is luminite. Look. Her. It was just Illuminite. It sent you weird again. Just like at Jordan's granddad's. No, Sadiq. I definitely saw her. The ghost from Terra Castle? No. Doomsday Dora. Doomsday Dora? Here? Yeah. Well, she was here. I think she came here, to the fairground, before the world split, before the adults vanished. <sighs> I saw her. Reese, it's all right. Please, listen to me. You know I'm always right about things. Reese, you can't say that kind of thing. No one likes kids who are up themselves. Nobody likes me anyway. Well, I do. Come on, we feel better when we've got out of here and away from that luminite. Doomsday Dora is trying to tell us something. For the children. That's us. then. Frankie, where are you going? One dried out gherkin, but no water. Follow me, the twigs dipping. There must be water here. Here! Told you the divining rod never lies. Help me! Three times, then two times. You have to pump it three times, then two times before the water is released. One, two, three, one, two. Yes! Frankie! You're a miracle worker! How did you know how the pump works? Because I'm fantastic, Frankie. The divine diviner. Where the... Frankie divined it with her special divining rod. She led us to this ancient pump on the church wall. Are you serious? Would I joke about something as important as this? She was amazing. Do you think she's got special powers? I doubt it. Where's your water, then? <sighs> the nearest fire hydrant's been taken by a pump tribe, wanting stuff in exchange for water. Do they want money? Money's no good to them. They want stuff they can eat or trade with. 
Let's go back and get more water, Liam. Good idea. Hold on a minute, why am I taking orders from you? Because I've got special powers. Plus, when I get back, you're worshipping me. <sighs> you must be back at the van. What's wrong with her? Seen another ghost. This time, Doomsday Dora dancing in the Luminite. Oi! Oi, Ami! Come back here! Ami, stop! Get back here! The children. You were here, Dora. You were. Can't turn it off once it's switched on. Can he? Turn on the right and jump in. Do it, Amy. Switch it on. Get off that right. Amy, I mean it. Amy, listen. You guys are in so much trouble. <laughs> <laughs> oh no! Someone must have followed us. We can't take on that tribe. He'll squash us. But it's our pump. I found it. Frankie, what are you doing? Thinking on my feet, like Sadiq said. Make way. This. Yes. I am Fantastic Frankie, and I discovered this ancient pump. Well, I am Happy Henry, and I've taken it over. It's a bad luck. But it doesn't work. Mm. Happy Henry, let's talk turkey. Here's the deal. You run the pump as a business, but I keep 50% of the takings as a finder's fee. 50%? No way. I haven't finished for a finder's fee and for telling you how to work the pump. Because without any water, you won't be happy Henry for much longer. 20. 40. 30. Done. And don't even think about double-crossing me, or I'll make that pump dry up, just like I did that fountain. Remember, I've got all the secrets. You better look after this one. She's special. on a timer switch. No, the leaves didn't that boot. One of them must have switched on, got into the ride, and now they can't get out of the ride to switch back off. <gasps> Why thank you, madam? To let rainwater. I hope you're happy. Lazing around doing nothing while the rest of us kill ourselves. It must be hard for you not being the resident princess anymore. And don't forget to wash Gretchen. <sighs> Frankie, we're raking in the loot. Don't you think you should tell Tia that you read about that tap in the book? Absolutely not. I like being special. <sighs> not sure she thinks you are. that fun ride. It must be behind it. Reese, do something! Reese! Help us! Use your powers! Don't you die! Power cables disappeared. 
Well, it can't. That's not possible. Another hot chocolate? No. There's a problem with Gretchen. What's going on, Frankie? Where's Gretchen? What is that? It's a solar camping shower. Its water is heated to 48 degrees by sunlight. It stores the sun's heat during the day and is now ready to use with luxury toiletries. I can have a shower. <laughs> I can wash my hair! <laughs> but when it's gone, it's gone. So you'll have to be quick and share. Share? I'm not sharing a shower with any of you. Even with my clothes on. I didn't mean us. I mean her. <laughs> You're right. For a kid. <laughs> you were awesome, Reese. You saved our lives. No, I didn't. Yes, you did. You stopped the riot and blew up the box with your mind. Oh, come off it, Jordan. Uh, we switched the power off? Yeah, to the whole of the fairground. See, it was Kat and Sadiq who saved us, not Reese. They stopped the power first. You can't say that for definite. Oh, yes, I can. Oh, well, Reese, you did good. And I, for one, always knew you were special. You don't need powers to be special, Reese. Hey, Sigbag said was right. She told me to stay away from the glittering lights, that they'll be bad for me, or something. Sorry, sickbag. Should have listened. It's a machine, you idiot. I'm a believer! Whoa! Hmm. Someone wants us to have another good sickbag. Dave, the door does! That's what I was trying to tell you, Sadiq. Door was here. Help me. Says, do not trust a stranger who comes bearing gifts. Can it not, Reese? It doesn't exactly sound like a message from Doomsday Dora. She has left us one. It's nothing. I know it's in here. We've got to go now, Reese. One more. Waste of time? Are we on a quest or are we spending time at a sideshow? It sounds like a sort of code. I'm not sure which, but we've really got to go, Reese. We think about it on the way. Come on. I will help you all I can in your great and noble quest. 
request. That's what Doomsday Dora meant when she said she was going to help us. She left us a clue. <coughs> and he's hit remove command while I was on terminal mode. I've lost Doomsday Dora's message. But you can quote it word for word. Reese, type in VAO7CN. See what comes up. It's a postcode. It's a postcode for the National Physics Institute. That's where we've got to go next, before the Spartacus project. Dora left that ticket in the psychic serum machine. So we'd find it. But how did Dora know we'd stop it? Well, it's on the main route out of Bristol. Obviously, any kid passing by is going to be dazzled by the flashing lights of a fairground. Right. You mean you believe, Reese? It would be highly unlucky to go against the prediction of psychic Sarah. <laughs> The would have been slashed if it weren't for that board blown in front of us. Maybe it was a... a sign. <clears throat> yeah, it is a sign. <sighs> National Physics Institute? National Physics Institute. <laughs> 